Okay, so let's give it up for a good friend of mine. He's great, great, uh, probably the best Belgian comedian at the moment in Flemish. He's up to do his first five or ten minutes of it in English. Give him a great applause. Come on, for Mr. Jeroen Lenders. because I hate myself, that's why I'm doing it. Um, uh, we have a lot of embedded ra uh, racism here in Belgium because uh, when, you, when you come in uh, and you pay, you get, you get, a, you get, a, you get this, you get this <laughs> stampy thingy, okay, you see it? And in front of me was this black guy. <laughs> uh, actually started like taking his hands where, where, where is enough white <laughs> on my hat? <laughs> it's quite racist to make it black. Maybe we should have some pink stamps for the black people. <laughs> oh, look, I'm pink over here. <laughs> All right. <laughs> but I like, I like talking English. I like the language. And I like it so much that I like doing English accents. I, li I love it. I love it. Certainly when I'm in France. When I'm in France, I like to speak French, but with an English accent, <laughs> which is really fun. We're sometimes we go for a, like a small holiday in Bretagne, and then I really, you, you have to speak French to French people, but with an English accent, it's really fun. So I, uh, if I ask the way to the sea, I do it like this. Excuse moi. <laughs> <laughs> Is a Jew of Lemur. It's all right. I mean, sir, your, your head is really like shining. <laughs> yeah, it's not really disturbing, but I just I really can see your head. <laughs> I don't see your entire head, I just see like a moon shape <laughs> sticking out of the audience. It's, it's quite like a moony idea. Like the moon doesn't shine on its own, uh, the moon reflects the light of the sun. That's how it works. That's how we know there's no hair on the moon. <laughs> There would be hair on the moon, we wouldn't even know it's there. <laughs> we would shoot rockets in space, and the astronauts would look like, what the fuck? There's like a big hairy ball over here. <laughs> they would land on it, and they would say, Houston, we need more shampoo. <laughs> We would have a totally different history, like the first words on the moon, we need, we need more shampoo. <laughs> like, I, lo I love nature, I really love nature, and I like to take hikes in nature with my wife and my, my kid, and, and, and I, re I get really upset when I hear certain news items. Uh, I, was, I was just watching television in, in my living room, and there was the, the announcement that they're, they're going to shoot deer in Belgium because we have too many deers. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like sitting in my sofa, I was, like, I was really upset. I, I, I really shouted at my television like, what, how? <laughs> how can there be too many deers in Belgium? In what way? Do we have too many deers? In that amount, you, we have to shoot them. How do we have too many deers? To do what? What do you want to do that you can't do anymore? Because we have too many deers. What kind of hobby do these people have? <laughs> they are so much deer related, they can't do it anymore. 
<laughs> it's ridiculous. Like people would ask me, hey Ruin, do you want to go along with No, I have too many beers of uh, <laughs> Definitely impossible now with all the beers. Uh, I would really like to go, but with all the beers, it's totally impossible. <laughs> you know what happened last week with all the beers? <laughs> Don't talk to me about beers. It's totally, it's, it's, it's totally stupid that we, we, we do not have too many beers. It's ridiculous. I'm, I'm 34. Do you know how many beers I saw in my life? <laughs> One! <laughs> it wasn't the way, but it was one beer. It's, it's too, we, we do not have too many beers. We have too little beers. If, if I go for a walk in the woods, and not if... <laughs> we call tree trees, we call it the wood. <laughs> in the woods. Sprinkle some bread to find your way back. <laughs> Why? Because the birds don't have the time to eat it. <laughs> because the wood is too small. <laughs> but you know, if I'm walking in the woods with my kid and I see a deer, you know what I say to my child? I say, oh, look, it's a deer! Look, did you saw it? It's a deer, boy! That's, that's a deer! Look, did you see the deer? That was a deer! Then there are not too little, uh, many deers in, uh... <laughs> if there would be too many deers, I would say, did you see the fucking deer again? <laughs> did you see the fucking deer? My child would think fucking deer is the actual name of the animal. <laughs> it's fucking deer. What did you have for Christmas for eating? Oh, we ate fucking deer. <laughs> and we ate gifts, we ate some more fucking deer. And then came Santa Claus with his old fucking deer. <laughs> and one fucking deer had a fucking red nose and his fucking deer nose. <laughs> It's ridiculous, man. We don't have too many deers, but now they're gonna send out hunters to shoot deers. And 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 according to hunters, we have way too many deers. <laughs> hunters that say, I don't want to shoot deers, but we have to. <laughs> there are too many deers. Hunters see deers everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. We don't see them. We don't see deers because we do not have, have trained eyes. <laughs> and deers are masters in camouflage. <laughs> we have five deers in here. <laughs> shoot deers and hunters they know it's insane because they always try to make a little nuance okay, so we're not just gonna shoot deers we're just gonna shoot the, the, the old deers and the sick ones <laughs> we're so we're good people we don't just shoot deers of course not just sick deers and old deers <laughs> see when a deer is sick. <laughs> when his wet nose and all. <laughs> but we're gonna shoot deers because the problem is, there's a really problem attached to it, is that the longer the more deers enter like inhabited regions, like in our living regions, that's, that's the problem that that we probably, that, that's most likely, that's the problem, that there, there are people uh, that are, that are people that see deers in their garden. <laughs> How mad can you be on deers? 
that in the morning you open your curtains and you see a deer in your garden, you say, that fucking deer in my garden! Again! Where's my gun? How mad can you be on deer? If I would open the curtain to see a deer, I would like wake up in my entire family and say, oh, there's a deer in our garden! But there are people say, what the, the fucking deer on my fucking... Is that a problem? Deers in your garden? Like the deer, the deer, the deer don't know that they're in their garden. In your garden, they just are on standing on grass, and they're, they're like thinking, like that's a really strange rock. <laughs> <laughs> it's not like they stood up and and just tried to ruin your day. It's like <laughs> they're gonna stand in his garden again. <laughs> <laughs> and when the curtains open, like, I'm not in your garden. <laughs> was another deer. <laughs> we all looked alike. <laughs> and when you turn around, they're like, la 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 la. <laughs> <laughs> it's ridiculous. And so like, we, 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 that, that's the problem, that there are too many deers and now they're coming in our garden. So like, when, you, when you count, we have like a few thousand deers in our country and we have like uh, 12 million people. So I don't think that the deers are in our way. I think we are in the way of deers. Actually, we, it's not like deers come in our inhabited regions. We inhabit deer regions. That's the way it is. Actually, deers have actually the right to shoot a few people. <laughs> so it would be on an acceptable population. <laughs> Not just anything, just the sick and the old. <laughs> <laughs>